Okay, class, I am here at three sentence tests. All of you, please read. The first box is green. The second box is bigger than the first one. The third box is the biggest among the three. Okay, very good. So I have a question. Please raise your hand if you want to answer. Okay, look at the first sentence. Is the first box compared to anything? Yes, wait. No, mom. It just uh, describes the first box is big. Yes, very good, wait. How about the second box? Is there any comparison? Yes, yourself? Yes, mom. What are being compared? The two boxes, mom. Very good, yourself. How about the third box? Charina? Mm -hmm. Yes, mom. Mm -hmm. Yes, very good, Charina. Do you think there are more than two things being compared? Yes, Giselle. Yes, ma'am. Very good. What were the shoes being compared? Yes, wait. Big, bigger, and bigger. <laughs> very good. All of you deserve a free clock. What? So for 
Can you read? Rose is more energetic than Mary. So what is the adjective we use here? Energetic. Okay, so energetic has two or more syllables. So we add more before the adjective. What is the adjective? Energetic. So how many persons we compare them? Rose and two. Okay, very good. Rose and Mary. So now class, who can give me another example of comparative degree? And weight? Uh the is pretty prettier than um Hershey. Giselle? Than her sheep. So how many persons we compare here? So, so, so Giselle and her sheep. So what is the adjective we use here? Prepare. Okay, so it belongs to the first way. So we add ER to the end of the word and it becomes prepare. Okay, so did you get it class? Okay, so now let's move on to the third degree, which is the comfort. So, for the fifth degree. So, what do you mean by compact? So, for the fifth degree. There two or more persons or things with one another. Okay, so in this class, we use to compare two or more persons. And, okay, so there are two ways that we Change the word to superlative degree. The first one is by adding ESD to, uh, to one syllable. Okay, so first example. Can you read that? Mark is the most handsome boy in the whole school. Uh, sorry, brother. The second one. Sarah is the oldest girl in the class. Okay, so what is that if we use here? Oldest.
dogs and we do three. Take two sample adjectives and we do Y. One sample adjective and they move one vowel in one persona. The three or more syllables and they will be two adjectives. So let us start with the one sample adjective that adds to the D.
we have, and that is that answer actually, and the group two got the highest score. So as what I said earlier, that the group that can get the perfect score will receive an award from me, but no one gets the perfect score. So I will give the group two uh, ex an extra point for this because they got the highest score. So you don't have to be sad, group one, because we have a lot of activities for the next days to come. So that ends our activity, and now let's have an assessment. Assignment. 